<laughs> Hola! Hola amigos, me amo Zach, a... That's all the Spanish I really know. For real guys, how's it going? It's Zach, and for Vlogmas 20, I wanted to bring to you guys a little bit of news that's going to be happening with my Bachelor of Theology's degree after the Crandall year is done, but I still have a required portion that I need to get taken care of for Acadia. You guys might be familiar with the Acadia course that I'm taking as a partnership with Crandall from last year when my nine friends and I went out to Acadia Divinity College to take two weeks of intensives. This year, we are doing things a little differently and our requirement is actually a mission trip to Cuba. This is going to be a first time thing for me on two fronts. I've never been to Cuba before, and I've never been on a missions trip. This isn't going to be your typical, let's go to Cuba, have vacation, go to the beach, shopping, all that kind of stuff. This is actually going to be a lot of ministry and working over in Cuba with Canadian Baptist Ministries to help people in poverty as well as in the community doing whatever is necessary. As exciting as this opportunity is, it comes with it a lot of stress, mainly in the term of financials. I need to raise $2,500 in order for me able to make this trip happen for the first week in May. That gives me roughly five months to get to 2,500 seems like a bit of a goal, but I'm positive and I'm believing that I'm gonna be able to do it. But I'm not going to be able to do it alone. I already have a fundraising account set up on CanadianBaptistMinistries.org, but I'm also going to be doing some external things to help me reach my goal before the due date is up. I spent about an hour to an hour and a half last night trying to figure out how to effectively work OBS for Twitch streaming. That's something that I've wanted to do in my personal life, but now that I have a legitimate reason for it, possibly getting funds off of donations from the stream, I figured now would be the best time to work on that. Of course, I'm going to be doing other things to help me reach that goal, including sponsorships from local churches and my own personal fundraising events, either here in town or off in Moncton. The big thing I wanna let you guys know about though is that I'm going to be making a GoFundMe page. So if you feel led to or you want to help out in any means by donating yourself or sharing it with friends and family who may possibly want to assist me, you can go to my page and donate by any means necessary, really. I'm really excited to go do this, both as a new experience for me and a way to practically grow my faith. Cuba is vastly different from Canada, which will require me to make a few adjustments and adapt to the culture around me, but I have heard so many awesome things about their culture that I just can't wait to get over there and dive in, helping any way that I can and being surrounded by a few of my friends that we've been going through this Bachelor of Theology program together. A few members of the class already have missions experience overseas, so I'm going to be in good company that way, not totally having a shot in the dark, but it's going to be different for all of us and I'm just excited to have this opportunity to share the journey with all of you guys. That's all I wanted to share with you guys today is that I will be working for the next five months to raise $2,500 for me to be able to do this missions trip to Cuba. And if you guys are willing to help me on that journey, I'll have links for my GoFundMe when I figure out how exactly to make that. If you guys enjoyed this video or like the idea of coming to Cuba with me through camera form, please be sure to hit the like button, share this video around with your friends and family who may also want to contribute to the cause, and subscribe so you don't miss any of my videos when I put them out by clicking that little bell right beside my username. It's down below the screen. You'll, you'll find it. I hope you guys are having a fantastic holiday season and will enjoy Christmas as well as New Year's and everything that happens in between. Later, guys.